Yo, what's going on guys? Nashra here, back with another NHL 19 shootout challenge, and with pond hockey season right around the corner, I figured we'd do a pond hockey special. This one's gonna be a little bit different, so we're gonna hop into NHL 19 ones, and how we score our goals in that game mode is gonna affect how we score our goals in the shootout challenge. We're gonna play one game of ones and copy the goals that we score over there into the shootout. So say I hop into my game of ones, I score a wrister from the mid slot. That means when we get into the shootout challenge, my first attempt has to be a wrister from the mid slot. Say our second goal is a one-hander, that means I'm gonna have to come over to the shootout and attempt a one-hander. So it's kind of interesting. I have to copy my moves and also I have to be strategic in which goals I score. Any shots that go into overtime of the shootout, that means I can just do whatever I want. And with that being said, let's get into what we're playing for. We're gonna have four total packs on if we win or lose this shootout. If we win, we keep all the cards. If we lose, we gotta discard everything in every one of these packs. Number one we have a mini thanksgiving choice a premium thanksgiving choice and then we have our two pre-order gold packs in there as well so we've got a lot on the line for this one before we get into this thing we got to figure out what sort of build we want to rock in this challenge and i'm leaning towards a dangler just because I know I want to score as many nice goals as possible so we can attempt those in the shootout. Let's go with 5-8 Dangler, man. I'm going to go short. I'm probably going to get killed out here, but we're going to give it a try anyways. 180 pounds, obviously shoots left. I think I'm going to go quick wrister because I know there's going to be a lot of times where I just need to shoot the puck and get that into the net. Secondary trait. Let's just bring it out, man. We're going dirty dangles. Why not? And then for our specialty, I think I'm going to rock spinster because usually I like to do a lot of the spin moves in ones. You got to like LT around, spin move around until you find the open space. So this is our build. It should hopefully work. Let's hop on in. Here we are on the beautiful outdoor pond. Man, it's been a while since I... Oh my... Dude, look at that guy in the middle. That is the best outfit I've ever seen. Yeah, it has been quite a while since we've been out on the pond and oh my... Wait, hello? All right, there's uh, one goal, mid slot, and red is back. Oh, we got one guy not here, so it's gonna be a one-on-one. -on -one. All right, so goal number one is a mid slot wrister. All right, yo, this actually couldn't have gone any better. We got a little one-on, oh, little spin move. Come on in, one-hander. Don't mind if I do, let's go. So we got a mid slot wrister. We got a one-hander. I gotta score at least five goals here. Let's focus up. Here we go, what do I wanna score next? I'm thinking a, uh, a Datsuk. If I could score a regular Datsuk, that'd be nice. Oh my gosh, dude. This is what I was worried about, man. I knew I was gonna get bodied. He has tied it at two. Okay, here we go. Give me a Datsu. Whoa! No! I probably should have just went with a normal Dots there. I would have wouldn't it. Okay, one-hander. Don't mind if I do. We'll take a second one-hander. So we've got a wrister, a one-hander, and another one-hander. I gotta switch this up now. I like to score lots of one-handers in ones, but obviously if I try every single attempt in the shootout to go with the one-hander, I'm gonna get demolished just like that. Okay, honestly, it's more important just to score three. So I'm gonna go Rister just to get a guaranteed. Now we need one more nice goal. All right, I'm gonna hit him with a little little LT action. See ya, bud. And then regular dots. I kind of messed that up. Definitely messed that up. Oh my goodness. What a nip, dude. All right, four to four. I need a Datsuk here to end it. We can end this thing right now. Oh my gosh. Datsuk, flip. Oh, oh, oh my, seven seconds left. We hit him with the Datsu flip ender. Yo, let me get one more. One ender. See ya, bud. Oh my, what a way to end it. Yo, I thought we were going to OT there. I bury the Datsu flip finisher. No angle. We settle with the dangle. Let's go. Ooh. Oh my gosh, dude. It doesn't get much better than that. That is our first game. All right, I'm gonna hop into replay mode here and make sure I have the order of those correct because we actually have to do them in the order that they appeared in the game. So first one, little wrister. So basically in the shootout, I have to sort of replicate this goal, which is gonna be a low opportunity shot for sure. So we'll try to cut across and shoot that left side. Okay, goal number two, we kind of spin off of him here, coming on net and yo. That is a cheeky one-hander, no angle there at all. We bury it, so that's shot number two. Our third shot in the shootout, this is basically the same goal we just scored, so it kind of stinks. We have to replicate the same goal 
twice in a row. I should have mixed that up a little bit. Four shootout shot. We have to cut over right side to left side. There's just absolutely no way I'm going to score on those, but we've got to do it. And for our final one, this is absolutely disgusting. We spin off him. Datsuk to the flip. Top left corner. Seven seconds remaining. So our last shootout goal has got to be a Datsuk flip. Dude, look at it from this angle. Goalie goes for the poke check. It goes about an inch wide and boom. That's the game winner. You guys are going to think I like repeated that one's game over and over so I got the perfect game. No, that literally was the first attempt. We got five nice goals. Now they're going to carry over to the shootout. We have to do them in that order. We're back to our random selection of our NHL team. We're going to hit X three times to get a random team. One, two, three, and we get the Edmonton Oilers. Hey, I'll take it. All right, yo, here we are popping into our first one. We got Hockey Master using the Avalanche. Let's hope he's not a Hockey Master. The order of these shots, we have a wrister cutting right to left. We have a one-hander, a one-hander, another wrister, and then for the fifth and hopefully the final shot, we end it with a Datsuk flip. But before we hop into any shots, we gotta make some saves here, boys. Let's go, big first save by Talbot, sit down. No, you know what sucks, dude? I gotta use McDavid for the most basic shot. Here, we'll put on the brakes, left side. Boom! That was, yo, that was basically a perfect replica of our first goal in ones. We got that wrister cutting left to right, and we'll take it. You know what, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't think I was gonna score a single goal with the wristers, but we did, and we're making saves. Yo, as long as we make saves here, we'll be good. Ryan Nugent Hopkins, we gotta one-hand it. One-hand it right side. Let's go! Oh, here we go. <gasps> He's coming in slow. Hits you with the fakes. Oh my gosh, dude. What a deke. All right, we got dry saddle. We got to do another one-hander. Unfortunately, same move twice in a row. Will it work? Oh my. <gasps> Yo, let's go. Don't give me that again. He's trying to take out my legs, referee. If we save this, we might win. I'm not sure. I think we do. Then, oh my. That patience, man. He's got me beat. Back to shot number one. I've got a righty, so I'm gonna alter it. So I'm gonna shoot right side with the wrister, all right? Here we go, a little toe drag, and patience. Let's go! Is that game? That's game! We copy the goals one for one. Basically did that to perfection. I don't think those could have looked any better. What an effort, buried the top right corner. Fortunately, we did not get to use our Datsu clip for the game winner, but hey, I'll take that. That's a big dub using the goals that we scored in ones in the shootout, and we now get to keep all four of our packs. After a successful game of ones and a successful shootout, it is time for pure disappointment, because let's be honest, we're not getting anything from these packs. But we do have four of them to open. We got our mini, we got our premium, and we have our two gold. So let's go ahead and kick it off. We'll kick it off slow and open up the two gold packs. Then we'll move into the mini and we'll end it with a banger with the premium Thanksgiving choice. Number one, these are just the pre-order packs. I had them sitting around. Over the course of the year, I think I've gotten two alumni from the pre-order pack. A gold collectible. Actually, you know what? I'll take that. Anything else at the end here? Not, oh, the Stingrays. Yo, those are kind of dope jerseys, I'm not gonna lie. And that's a big pack, man. Nothing good, though. We got our gold collectible. You know what? I'm gonna be happy with that. I just, I have this feeling in my mind. We're getting an 89 alumni here. I don't know where it's coming from. Oh, 83 Eric Stahl. That's not bad from a little free gold pack. We'll take that. 81 Sergachev. You know what? This pack's actually not too shabby. Even if that's all we get, I'll be somewhat happy. And it is. Okay, we get a Sergachev. We get an Eric Stahl. Now it is time. The mini Thanksgiving choice pack. I think there's three rounds here. The first one, you get a player. The second one, you get like jerseys and logos and stuff. And the third round is a guaranteed Thanksgiving collectible. So the only round that really matters here is round number one. So we're going to see it pop up right away. Cue the hype music. Give me something. Final card here. Card number five. A banger. Guaranteed. We're scrolling right to the end. Okay. A bit of a disappointment to say the least. Yeah, I said it going into the pack opening. This was going to be a bit of a yikes. And uh, yeah, right here, right now, we're seeing how rough these packs are, dude. And the final one, I think this is guaranteed. Yeah, guaranteed Thanksgiving collectible, which I will take. I mean, I, I need all those I can get. I'm trying to build that, that 91 cane. So we'll take those two and move on into our final pack of the day. All right, here we are. I haven't done a pack opening on YouTube in a long time. I haven't done a hockey stick pack and even longer. So I think we're overdue. I'm popping this open with the A button. And here we go. Oh, I missed. That was a bad 
Here we go, boys. We got the pack popping open. I think we have two rounds where we can get gold players in here. We start out with the 71. Not great. 75. Brandon Saw. Oh, my God. Gosh, dude. 80 overalls. Please tell me that is not the best cards we're getting in this pack. Final card. Pop. 61 overall. Could get any worse than that. Well, here we are. Round number two. We're due for... Oh, my. Three gold commons in a row. We're just going to take our time here. No hurry. We've got two last cards. These are the final two players that we can get from this pack opening. Pop. So far, we only have three 80 overalls. Pop. Pop. Well, GG, boys. It's just the arenas and the jerseys and the logos, so... Every time I do a YouTube pack opening, it ends up like this. Like, I'm on Twitch popping packs every now and then. We pull alumni. We pull 85s, 86s. This pack opening... I'm gonna go take a look at the probabilities. We got an 81 overall. That was the highest card that we got in the premium. This is like a $15 pack. Come over here, view the pack probabilities, and we have a 66% chance of getting an 83 plus and i only got two 80s and an 81 man so yeah unfortunately that's gonna do it for this pack opening man this video was so sick too we did well in ones we copied those ones moves over to the shootout won the shootout and we get rewarded with an 81 overall player man i still had a lot of fun with this one we made some moves scored some nice goals and i'm not gonna lie boys this has got me ready for pond hockey season if you guys are ready to play some pond hockey or you enjoyed this video be sure to hit the video with a like also comment down below let me know if you want to see more challenges like this one because i had a lot of fun with this so that's gonna be it for this one hope you guys have a good rest of your day subscribe if you haven't and i'll talk to you next time peace